guys welcome back to my channel I hope you all are doing really well today so for this video I wanted to do my 10 minute routine where this is just something that you can put a little bit of makeup on and look put together without doing a full face of makeup so hopefully this is something that um, you can get some inspiration from and to maybe work into your everyday routine and so yeah I hope you all enjoy the video and let's go ahead and get started Hey guys, so I am just showing here um, timing how long it'll take me. I will be skipping through um, just to speed up certain clips of the video, but that doesn't really go towards like how long it took me to actually do it. And here I'm just priming the skin with the NYX Angel Vel Primer, and I do that just because um, I find that my skin sense of how oily it is that I still need to prime and that just helps um, and then here I'm just applying the tape shape concealer in the areas that I find that I want some uh, coverage and to just cover up any blemishes or um, dark spots redness and stuff and then I'm just gonna go in and blend it out with my beauty blender and again I just do this so that um, I have like a smooth face and I cover up any areas that I don't want to be shown with the concealer just so that um, it looks like I have just like a nice um, skin like finish uh, how do I describe this like just like looks like skin without it looking cakey like as if I had on foundation so that's why I am doing that Next, I'm going to go in and set all the areas that I put the concealer with the Cody Earthman powder. And this also helps um, just make my skin really smooth. On a day like this where I wouldn't be wearing a ton of makeup, you don't have to set everything. But again, since I do have oily skin, I find that it just helps um, control the oils a little bit more. And um, this Cody Earthman powder is really, really nice because it makes the skin look super smooth. So that's why I still set my face um, with powder. So next, now I'm going in and I'm just going to lightly bronze up the skin. And I do this so that my face has some color to it without it looking like... I'm caking it up and putting on a lot of powder. This just helps give my face like a nice natural flush and um, I just like it in this one in particular um, just makes a really nice natural like shadow. And here I'm about to go in and do my eyebrows which of my whole routine this probably takes the longest to do um, just because I don't have the best eyebrows honestly and I'm kind of picky about how they look so I just go in and lightly mostly fill in the sparse areas and draw them out so that they're both even and again this is something that maybe you could skip if you already have some uh, pretty good looking eyebrows but I just do this because um, I like my eyebrows to look kind of put together I guess and so using this L'Oreal um, brow stylus pencil um, helps me achieve that so yeah and this is also the first time I'm really doing my brows on camera usually I skip it in my tutorials just because um, they take a while but when I'm doing this routine I don't go into as much detail um, so yeah And here I'm just setting my brows with a little sample size of the Benefit Gimme Brow. Um, this is, I think, the second time I've used it. Usually I just use a different um, little brow mascara, but I'm really liking it. So I think I'm going to go out and get the full size of the Gimme Brow. Um, but we shall see after, like, what I think of it after using it a couple more times. And here I am just going to be applying a light coat of this CoverGirl Voluminous Mascara. Um, this is also a mini size that I got from Target. Um, they had it in like this little sample size area and so I decided to pick it up. And it just makes my lashes um, separated and gives just like a really light natural coat to them. So that's why I like using that for when I'm doing this type of look. And then next, I'm just going to apply a touch of blush um, just because sometimes I think my cheeks need a little bit of rosiness. 
And then here I am just setting the face with the L'Oreal um, setting spray. And here is the final time for how long it took me. And again, I know it, um, like how long the video is doesn't translate to how long it took me to do it. But I just wanted to speed through some areas just to show, um, just because I didn't want to show all of it. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye! Thank you.